Hey guys, it's Wotam. Just doing a video on the uh, tunnel section in The Last of Us. This was recorded on uh, my Grounded Plus run. Some people have a lot of trouble with this. Um, I read a lot of posts about people, you know, trying to kill everything in the tunnel. And the fact is, you can actually get through the entire thing, really, with only having to take down uh, two enemies. Uh, first of all, this guy here. Now, obviously, you want to make sure you sneak up on him and don't make too much noise. But once you grab him and choke him out, uh, you're pretty much clear to move on through. So you take him down, and then you just move along. But really, this entire section can be uh, done using stealth for the most part. Um, you don't need to uh, have any supplies or uh, really do anything except a couple of chokeouts. And you'll get through it without much trouble at all. So you just move along carefully past this uh, truck here. Uh, keep in mind that there is a clicker on your left, but if you go slow, they're not going to hear you. And then once you get past this tree, you just kind of hook around to the right. And you can go through the water and then jump over that, uh, that railing onto the walkway. Now, some people prefer to um, just kind of continue going through the water, but there's a couple of clickers there that, frankly, I prefer to not have to deal with, especially on Grounded, where their hearing is very sensitive. So I prefer to head on through this door to the right. Uh, there are some supplies over to the right in the corner there if you uh, feel like grabbing them. And when you go, come up the stairs here, just go slow, and there's going to be another infected in front of you who you need to then take down. So if you just grab this guy and choke him out. Uh, there's two others up ahead who seem to pay absolutely no attention, so that's good. And once you've taken him out, you then go around to the left into this hallway, and that then takes you back out into the, uh, the main section of the tunnel. Um, I will mention that if you go around to the right uh, and through a door straight ahead onto some shelving, there are some parts there if you still need parts. Otherwise, you just head on through, slowly go down into the water, again, making sure not to make too much noise because clickers are very sensitive to noise. And then just move along through here. That uh, truck with the red marking on the right there has a manual on the roof if you have not previously picked that up. But essentially what we want to do is just head on over here to the walkway. Uh, be very careful of that runner. Um, he is quite sensitive from a hearing perspective. But if you sneak along slowly, he won't hear you. Uh, the bloaters aren't paying any attention to you and the clicker is too far away. Now there are some bricks here. I've already got a brick in my inventory. So basically all you really need to do is pick up the bricks don't hit anybody with them and just throw them at the uh, posts and try to get the enemies to be alerted. I accidentally uh, hit the melee button here and then I also aim my gun by mistake. But basically what you want to be doing is just pick up bricks and throw bricks. And eventually you're going to get enough brick throwing going on that the loaders at least will be paying attention. And at that point you can then sneak past the uh, clicker. So similar to some other areas in the game, you can very easily get by this clicker. You just have to go slow and be quiet. Uh, the bloaters are distracted off to the right. However, you'll notice in a few seconds as I'm crawling along here, a bloater comes uh, pretty much right up to me, but for some reason he doesn't uh, see me, which I guess is fortunate. And then uh, as I'm coming up here, when I hook around to the right, there's actually the other bloater is actually standing right there. Um, but again, they're not paying any attention to me, so that's uh, that's good. And basically what you want to do now is just get to the point where you can hit the triangle prompt to boost Ellie up. And she'll drop down the box. And then uh, normally I just go hide in the corner until that, uh, that event uh, passes, and then I just hop up onto the roof. So that's, uh, that's about it. It's actually very easy to get through. Uh, you don't need to kill anybody except for those two uh, runners that you need to choke out. So, if you have any questions, you can find me on the uh, Last of Us forums on playstationtrophies.org, and I hope this has been useful. You guys have a great day.